Who gets access to Internet bandwidth, and how much should they pay for it? That's at the center of a CRTC hearing into the future of Internet pricing in Canada. Here's Margaret McDermott. My name is Mark Coatsworth, and I run a small technology services business in Toronto. Called Built Mark by Coatsworth made a, a special trip to these hearings to make the point that paying the more for the Internet ISPs will hurt his small Toronto tech company. For the next five years, it will grow exponentially to the point where we are just paying unbelievably large sums for services that, that we should be getting at marginal cost. And especially compared to, again, compared to the Americans, we're, we're getting killed. Canadians use the Internet not just for email, but for television, social media, and to download movies. Telecom companies rent out access to their cable networks to small, independent providers. But the big companies say it's costing them money to beef up their equipment to handle all the traffic. So they want to charge the small, independent companies more. And we're trying to figure out how that usage component should come up with the right price so that they can have a viable business, but at the same time, they compensate us for using our network. The consumer group, Open Media, says cable companies are just trying to meter the Internet. There's a few companies that have a stranglehold over the market, so we don't have a lot of choice, and then thus the prices are, are, are high. And those big companies, that they want to make the Internet more expensive. Canadians are in the top third in the world when it comes to how much they pay for the Internet. This Internet law expert says these hearings are all about future access and control. It's fundamentally about the amount of competition that we have in Canada around Internet services, which then has a major impact on the kind of pricing and opportunities and services that Canadians face. These hearings continue all week with parties on all sides telling the CRTC just how much they think using the Internet should really cost. Margot McDermott, CBC News, Ottawa.